Hello, Mike here from Mike Overlanding. In this short video, I'll go over the HEST pillow, which is an amazingly practical pillow. I think this is a useful must-have pillow for so many situations, especially camping. Let's get started. Here's how you open, deploy the pillow. Simply unzipper it, invert the pillow, and then close up with the zipper. And this is actually the pillow part that you sleep on, right here. And to put it away, you just simply reverse the process. This is a little bit more difficult cramming it in here, but it works. Cram it in there, find the zipper, zip it up, and there you go, back to normal. Another feature of this is there's a zipper here, and you can remove the outer cover to wash it. And finally, if this pillow is too firm for you, you simply open it up and inside here, you unzip this other area and there's a zipper here and you can open up the inner pillow and remove some of the stuffing. So if it's too big for you or too firm, there's a quick fix. Here's what I like about the pillow. First of all, it's durable and water resistant. Here is the water test. Seems to run right off. It turns inside out to protect and keep clean the part that your head rests upon. It fits nicely in a sleeping bag. Much better than a full size pillow. It's very comfortable, soft, breathable. It's more compact than a regular pillow. It's more comfortable than an air pillow and it retains more heat in cold weather than an air pillow. I'm not knocking air pillows. They have their purpose. They're great for backpacking when weight and volume is important, but uh, if you're camping, this is a great pillow. The curve contours your head, which helps when sleeping in a somewhat upright position. Keeps the pillow from rolling off you. It has a removable washable cover. The manufacturer says that the pillow is designed to be compact for long periods of time However, my advice is that uh, don't keep them compact. Open them up like you would a sleeping bag. This helps the insulation stay fluffy, which is what makes it comfortable, and helps retain the warmth. As of this date, the manufacturer's website has 31 reviews, all five star. What could be done to improve the pillow? The only thing I can think of is, is the jingling of the zipper. Uh, I'm a light sleeper, so I hear that a little bit when I move around. Uh, so if there's a way to put a quieter zipper on, that'd be great. And the only other thing I could think of is maybe they could make one where the outside cover is not just water resistant, but waterproof. There have been many times I've been up in the Boundary Water Canoe Area Wilderness in northern Minnesota, Canadian border, and we're canoeing and it's pouring rain. In fact, one time we flipped the canoe and a lot of things got wet, so uh, fortunately I keep everything in a watertight bag, but you wouldn't need a watertight bag if this had automatically had its own watertight bag. What are some of the uses? I use it for overlanding in my rooftop tent. You can use it for car camping or van life. Uh, this is my primary pillow for my rooftop tent. You can use this for tent camping, road trips, picnics, hospital, the manufacturer website even talks about a guy who took it to the hospital while his wife was giving birth. 
uh, airplanes, trains, Airbnb, motels, I guess if you want to bring your own pillow. Ton of uses for it. I think camping is the best. So what are the specifications? The dimensions are 22 inches by 15 inches by 8 inches, and this is fully deployed. When it's packed up, the dimensions are 14 inches by 9 inches by 7 inches. And it weighs 2.2 pounds per the manufacturer. Here's a comparison of the sizes. This is when it's folded up, obviously. Here's when it's fully deployed. And you can see the difference between a regular house pillow and the HEST pillow. Question is, how much does this cost? I paid full price for this. It cost $79, and I purchased it in early 2022. What I probably should do is stick my hand in here and see if I feel any water on the inside. <laughs> Zippers, you gotta love them. <laughs> doesn't work. <laughs> okay, zipper, let's try it. All right, here we go. Let's do this all. I'm gonna do that once. Keep tape. Keep taping. Oh, shoot. Sucker back together. <laughs> Be sure to check out Mike Overlanding for more videos. Please subscribe and like this video. And thanks for watching, I hope this was useful to you.